you job. At the beginning of the year, I said I was going to lose some weight. I went back to doing my old, like, health plan. Didn't really work out well. Kind of fucked up. Kind of, you know, a little bit f- funny things going up on, up in uh, up in my house up there. So, I decided to try something new. Something different. Something I've seen before online. Never really done it before. But, I think this will work. Okay? So, I'm going to try and pick this up. Because it's so fucking long. Okay. Freshly. Okay. This box weighs 28 pounds. Oh my god. I think I just broke my back. I think I just broke my back. Yeah. Okay. So. Freshly. Why? Why have I decided to do this? I'm going to open it down here. By the way. Uh, why have I decided? Why? Why has Husky decided to buy Freshly? Well, well, citizens and friends, um, this is why. I'm terrible with money. I'm just going to be straight up honest. I'm terrible with money. I already spent like $17 today on something I don't need. Um, like literally, I never would need what I bought today. Um, so, my big brain idea here is that if I buy this, then this is my meals. That's it. It's 12 meals. So, I'm buying 12 meals. It's about 120 bucks. Um, sounds a little, well, about 110 bucks. Sounds expensive. I used to spend 140 to 150 bucks on food myself. So, technically... I mean, doing this, I'm going to save some money. It's only going to be a little bit of money, but still, I'm going to save some money. Um, so it's six. So it's twelve meals. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to eat two meals a day, and I'm going to be like I have to for myself. I have to eat my own meals, one day, one day a week. Eat my own meals. Um, reuse me. Store in your freezer as a nice pack. Recycle me. Defrost gel pack, cut corner and discard non-toxic, water-soluble gel and trash. Step four, recycle bin. Okay. Um, cool. So here's, for an example, let's get this one, because this one. Okay. So for an example, this is a meal. Right here, right? So this is Mexican-style shredded beef. Right? So of course, it doesn't look great in that packet right there. But what this is what we're gonna do. Um, we're going to. So this is just kind of like the intro video of why I did this. I'm terrible with money. I needed to lose some weight. I think eating two meals a day would do that. Would help me with that. Help me get kick started anyway. These meals are a hundred times better than anything I can fucking make myself because I don't know how to make food. And as long as I can do it on the stove, I do fine. But other than that, I'm fucked. Um. This, though, I think will be really cool. So what we're going to do is every single day, and this is, this is you know, um, every single day, I will go live, and I will eat the food on stream. So if you're part of my Twitch community, I'll eat it on stream. I'll eat the food on stream, and then I'll do a quick, like, one-minute review of what I thought of the meal. I'll show what the meal was supposed to look like versus what it actually looked like. All these different things. And I'll go over the end of it, after the end of the twelve day, of the six days, I'll go over exactly what I thought of the entire thing. Um, and whether or not I'm buying again. So, um, I think it will be interesting to see what happens. I'm excited, because I think it will be something, un- I think this is something unique and different, that I've never tried before. So, um, with that being said, all the next stuff you're going to see is from the next six days. So, yeah. I'll see you guys tomorrow morning. Good morning. Day one. It's March 15th. It is 8 something in the morning. Um, I just had my first meal. It's right here. So this is the image of what it's supposed to look like. This is what it does look like. It looks very similar. Um, 
a ton of more green beans. Uh, so just so you guys know as well, this was homestyle chicken with butternut mac and cheese and with green beans. <clears throat> butternut squash mac and cheese was incredible. Um, the green beans I actually liked. And the chicken is in my top three all time chickens I've ever tasted. Overall, we're starting off this adventure um, incredibly. Um, if this is what all the meals are going to taste like, I can't wait to try tonight's meal. But uh, yeah, overall, great meal. Loved it. Meal two. Uh, meal two today was cod cakes with spicy chipotle sauce and succotash. Here's my version of it. This is what I got. This is the version that's on their website. Um, overall, really good. It was another really good one. The fish was very, um, it wasn't overpowering. It wasn't a very strong fish taste. Um, the spicy chipotle sauce kind of, like, almost, like, uh, ran off of it and ran into the succotash. No, I don't ever think I've had succotash before, so succotash was really good. I enjoyed it. There's also potatoes, as you can see. Quite big, a few potatoes. I like potatoes. I'm a big potato guy. I like potatoes. Um, overall, really good meal. Another really good meal. Um, it's gonna be interesting. It's currently a little bit past 1.30. Uh, it'll be interesting to see how I'm feeling tomorrow morning when I wake up and eat. Um... So expect to hear about that tomorrow. But yeah, overall, strong two meals. Two strong meals to start this whole uh, experiment off with. So, see you guys tomorrow morning. Good morning, YouTube. It's Monday. It's a little bit past 7 o'clock right now. I just got done eating. Um, this morning we had the Sicilian-style chicken parm with broccoli. Um, yet again, a really good meal. Um, one thing I wanted to show you guys, though, that I didn't show last time, or I haven't and I'm going to show you guys, is the thickness of the chicken, right, there we go, look at that, like, this isn't a small piece of chicken, this is a thick-ass big piece of chicken, it's really good, good taste, um, it's moist, good flavor, the only thing I wish is that there was a little bit more mozzarella cheese, as you can see from the pictures, the mozzarella cheese kind of, like, fully, like, goes away, um, broccoli tasted really good, yet again, this is another standout, I knew it would be, but I'm still just shocked that I've had three meals and all three of them are like very, very, very good meals. <clears throat> like I'm impressed. Afternoon, everybody. It is a little bit past two o'clock right now and we've met our first bad meal. Bad meal. I didn't enjoy this. Uh, as you can see, this is meal four. It's the Mexican style shredded beef with masa cakes. There's their version. There's my version of what I got. It just did. The masa cakes, there was no taste to it, which was weird. It was just zero taste. The shredded beef had a weird seasoning slash taste. I don't know what it was. I just don't know what it was with this whole thing. I just, I didn't, <clears throat> I didn't enjoy this dish. Let me put it like that. Um, It was just, it was, it was the one that I was looking most forward to eating. Or one of them. I was, you know, the the first meal was the one that I was looking forward to the most. But this one was one of the ones I was looking forward to. Just the taste was off. There was something with the taste off. Might just be me. It might be the entire thing. But I just that isn't for me. So so far, that's our first miss of the. Uh... Good morning, everyone. Um, it is Tuesday. Uh, a little bit past six. I just had. Steak peppercorn with sautéed carrots and French green beans with mashed potatoes. Potatoes, really good. Really good. The vegetables, yet again, really good. Um, the potatoes were very um, creamy, it felt like. And then the steak, I actually saved a piece to show you guys. So as you can see in the images here, the steak looks kind of flat and mine looks big and thick. That's how thick my fucking steak was. Like, this is no small-ass steak. Like, these are... These, like, protein meals are big, thick things, you know? Um, the steak was chewy. It melts in your mouth. And, like, I was fucking... I'm shocked still. Um, yeah, this is another... We're back on the hits. All right, guys, this is meal six. This is my, lun my lunch slash dinner for Tuesday. 
Um, it was chicken Livorno with white beans and kale. And if you look in the pictures here, right, there was also like carrots. There was also potato, oh, not potatoes, tomatoes. There was also bacon. Um, I'm trying to think what else there was. I mean, there felt like there was a lot of different stuff in it. I wasn't sure what to think of this entire meal when I first like was like, oh yeah, let's you know, let's do this, right? Let's you know, let's buy this one. I have no idea what chicken Livorno is. I have no idea what, you know, the kale, right, what kale and white beans taste like, to be 100% honest with you. I had no idea. I loved it. This was such a great dish. It was warm. It was hearty. It felt like something that you would eat when you're sick, like like your grandma would eat when you're sick. Um, this is definitely a huge, huge one. I'm putting this in my, like, probably in the top five. This is going to be a top five meal so far that I've had from Freshly. Um, big ups to them. This is really, this was really good. I was shocked. Good morning, guys. It's hump day. Um, today, as you can see, I had chicken tikka masala with vegetable biryani. Um, one of the closest image ones that we've had, um, since I started doing this. The only thing I'll say is that not a whole lot of chicken, it felt like. Um, if you can see from their picture, right here, tons of chicken. And then if you see in my picture, right there, like, the chicken was a lot smaller, um, than theirs, and then the picture that they had, um, but overall, it was really good, it was a really good meal, it tasted just like it should, um, I used to eat chicken tikka masala when I was a kid in England, um, so it's one of my personal, like, one of my oldest favorites, you know, um, the only thing I'd say is if they added one piece of, like, naan bread, just to wipe up the extra, um, sauce, oh, that would make it perfect, but it's really good. Meal you guys. Um, it was turkey mushroom meatballs with zoodles and spring pesto. You can see the pictures here. Um, this is the first dish that I've had. The as I got done with it, I wanted more. Like I really wanted more of it. Um, the zoodles is kind of a newer thing to me with spring pesto. It was really good taste. Um, of course I salted it a little bit, so that helped. Um, but it was a really good, strong, nice taste to it. The turkey, the turkey mushroom meatballs were incredible. I didn't even notice the meatball, uh, the mushroom part of it. Um, I like mushrooms, so it's no big deal for me. But overall, this is just a really nice, hearty meal that, like, I wish there was more of. That's it. Like, I mean, there's, there's nothing else really to say. I mean, it was a good, good tasting meatball. The meatballs were really big sized as well. Um, yeah, I mean, just fucking A+. Plus. Today's meals have been very good, surprisingly. Um, a lot better than I thought they were going to be. So, there's that. Good morning, one and all. It's Thursday. Um, I had a rough night sleeping. <clears throat> but for my meal today, I had, uh, there it is. Chicken and spring pea risotto with mushrooms and seasonal herbs. Um, I've never had risotto before. Surprisingly enough, I've never had it before. That meal, as you can see here, is, was fucking incredible. Um... The chicken was the the chicken surprisingly was the worst part of it. The chicken was just kind of dry. It well, was not dry. It was moist, but it was dull. There was no flavor to it. It was just chicken. But the risotto, holy shit, it was creamy. It kind of was. It tasted like it was cheesy at the same time. And the mushrooms had gone off the chicken into the risotto. Um, yeah, I'm a huge fan of this. I'm definitely gonna be buying this one again. Um, but this was the first time when the protein let down the meal, which I thought was interesting. So. But overall, really good meal. Really good meal. Afternoon, everybody. I just got done eating carved turkey and grain-free stuffing with gravy and seasoned carrots. You can see the images right here. <coughs> um, it was a very weird meal. The seasoned carrots were really good. There's yellow carrots in there, and I don't know if that's a normal carrot or not, but those are really good. Um... The turkey was dry, unless you got a piece that had the gravy on it. The gravy was really good. I really enjoyed the gravy. The gravy really added to it. The grain-free stuffing was the weirdest thing I think I've ever eaten. Like, I, I don't know how I feel right now after eating this. It was a very odd... It was a very odd meal to me. Like, I, I made it as Thursday, because, you know, like, Thursday dinner, Thanksgiving. It's a very odd meal to me, though. I don't know. I'm probably not going to get this one again. This is a very odd meal. More bad. I mean, the gravy was good. But overall, I don't know. 
Good morning, everybody. Um, hard morning for me to wake up, sorry. Um, we had, as you can see, sausage baked panini with sauteed zucchini and spinach. The first thing you guys should notice is that it's not on a plate, it's in a bowl. Okay, um, it was a lot smaller of a meal. Size-wise, it was a lot smaller. <coughs> um, the sausage was cooked nicely. There was a few pieces in it. And the panini was cooked nicely. Um, there's some tomatoes in it. There's some uh, spinach in it. The weird thing is the zucchini. The zucchini is like fucking like little chunks of zucchini. Um, but overall, a really good meal. Um... It's a real good meal. It's a very small meal, though, like I said. It's in a bowl, not a plate. Um, that's why it looks a little different on my view here. But yeah, no, I liked it. it was good. Afternoon, everybody, and the final meal of the day. <laughs> As you can see here, I'm going to mess up saying this. It's um, andouille and chicken gumbo with dirty rice and veggies. Um, this is really good. It was a really hearty, warm meal, which is great for me up here right now, and uh, the Northeast Kingdom of Vermont, where it's wicked fucking cold. Um, overall, it was really good. I, there's, there's not a whole lot that I can complain about with this. It was just, it was warm. It was a nice taste to it. The whole, the whole dish had a really nice taste. The picture over here really doesn't do it, like, justice. The picture doesn't look that good, but the taste of it was very good. Um, I really liked it. It was another really good dish. And it was a good dish to end the entire... 12 meals, because we're done with all 12 now. Um, it was a good meal to end it on. Um, I thought this would be a good one. I really did enjoy it. Um, everything works really well together, so... There's nothing to complain about here. I liked it. You know? Alright, guys, so that's all 12 meals done. That's my first order that I put in. Um, overall, I think for the price, this was worth it. It was meals that I really can't... Like, it would take me a long time to figure out how to make these meals, first of all. Two, like I'm spending, I'm gonna spend more money and make more food for the same price, which is not a good thing when I'm a big guy anyway and I'm trying to lose some weight. You know what I mean? Um, I only had two meals out of the entire thing. Only two of these were really bad. So I mean, I can't. I don't think it's, like I think this is a really good deal. It's it's to, for for me, right? I think this is a really good meal. It, a real deal, deal meal, deal meal, deal meal. Um. It's 12 meals. It was 110 bucks. I haven't tried all the meals. This is just the first one. Um, spoiler alert. I reordered again. And I ordered brand new things. So if you guys want to see what's on that the new list. Let me know in the chat. You know, drop it down in there if you want to see more of this. Um, I'm also going to put down <coughs> um, timestamps for each meal. So then that way you guys don't have to, if you guys don't want to, you don't have to watch the full thing. You guys can just watch like the, like the intro and then certain meals. Um, but overall though, I really enjoyed this service. I thought it was really well done. They communicate with you easily. The shipping is really easy. It's a big ass box. Um, the meals taste great. You don't have to buy 12 either. I think the lowest you can buy is four. So, um... Overall, like, it's one of those things, like, even if you're looking at, like, not spending money to buy dinners or, like, lunches or something like that, this is something that I would consider doing if you're single. Um, in a relationship, it could be a little bit more because of, it's expensive. Um, but single, though, like I said, I used to spend 140 to 150 bucks a week on food. And it wasn't good food. This was good food. Like, just overall, good tasting, healthy food. You know, I can't complain, man. This is just really good. Freshly, I'm all in. I'm all in. Your boy Husky's all in. Um, I'm going to be buying from these guys weekly now. Like, literally every single week I'll buy. Um, I only eat two meals a day now. I eat one at breakfast, uh, breakfast, six to seven. I eat one at din uh, lunchtime, you know, like 12 to one. And that's it. You know, and I'm not hungry. So, I'm all in. This is beautiful. I can't say enough good things about this right now. Like I said, those two bad meals. And by bad meals, I mean, I just didn't like them. Some other people like them. I just didn't. So, um, yeah. That's it, man. If you're looking, if you're looking for some good food that you don't have to cook, that's a little bit more expensive because it's already been made, but you don't want to make it. Check these guys out, man. Freshly. 
I'll leave a link in the description too. How about that shit? Um, yeah. Hope you guys are staying safe. Right, and I'll see you guys in the next video that will be on the channel. I don't even know what it is. So I'll see you there, though. Bye.